Yamaha's Greg Dawson is part of the second group of riders who's arrived for the Yamaha media event out at Deer Camp and is ready to head out into the field. So far, I think it's just the camaraderie of, of everybody that is in this industry come together to share ideas, share experiences, and, and really help us out as hunters to become successful. I think having Wade's team paired with the Yamaha Doors team, it's been kind of this um, really cool synergy of all of this industry knowledge that coming in as a new hunter, I mean, I can't buy that experience. In a hunting situation, you've got a lot of different people coming in. Um, you know, you're going to hunt in different scenarios. You know, we've got box blinds and we've got ladder stands and pop-ups. you got to go where the deer go. You know, and the scouting cameras are starting to show a lot of deer around this one particular stand. And, you know, we got Greg out there who was on his first time hunting. And, you know, he kind of had the lucky draw if it started storming again because he was going to be in a box blind. But we, in some of those situations, you're going to get picked off on the left side or the right side by an old wary buck or, or a, a you know, a pretty smart node that's going to come in and pick you off because you're focused in front of you a lot of times. So I always remember those box blinds look left and right because Greg learned a pretty valuable lesson on his hunt. Greg took some time in between hunts to stay comfortable shooting the Thompson Center Venture, and now he's back out in the box blind for the second afternoon, hoping to get another chance. So we had been sitting there for probably about an hour and a half. A couple does and fawns came in uh, right off in, in front of me and started feeding, and it kind of just calmed down the area, I think. Um, and then shortly after that, the fawn actually got spooked and started to run off a little bit, and I. I was like, okay, we're, we're busted, we're, we're done, there's no more. But as she went to run off, right behind her was this just beautiful eight point buck that as soon as I saw him, I was like, okay, this is the guy. This is the one that I'm gonna have my first hunt with. and he was off in the distance, just his, his rack right up there. He started walking towards us and took a slight turn like he was gonna go away. And again, I was like, okay, busted again. But then he took another turn and he started coming towards us. I started breathing a little bit heavier, like really in the moment. Um, started to bring the, the barrel up. I hit the blind like three times thought I was going to spook him off. All the uh, adrenaline was pumping and finally got the barrel out there, lined up the shot, and took it. This was my first deer hunt ever. Coming into it, I really didn't know what to expect. People would kind of tell me about their first hunt, but in reality, um, I really, it, it was such an experience that I'll never forget. Yeah, he's gonna feed the family and, and uh, I'll honor him with a spot on, uh, on my wall. <laughs> 